If you don't have a BOSU, elevate your heels with small dumbbells under them like this. This is going to isolate your quadriceps. Honestly, this is a compound movement, so your entire lower body is engaged. But because of the uh, a more upright position of this squat, you should feel it more in the quads. And if you have a thinner band, I would actually encourage you to use it as well. So you put it above the knee, or you actually can put it uh, at the lower ankle, but this is always my preference. But um, I know you, some of you have a preference to ankles, which is totally fine. So here's what we're doing today. You can hold dumbbells if you wish. I like to start with them in my hand and then get rid of them when I lo no longer can perform the movement properly uh, with uh, precise form. So this is the tempo in which you're going to do this exercise. Please mind it. We're going to do five squats. Back is straight, hips and shoulders come down and up together. Five of these, four. So nice smooth movements. After we do five, you're gonna go back down and you're going to do micro movements. So up and down for five, four. Three, two, one, pulse for five, four, three, two, and hold, half the weight for five, four, three, this is the tempo, two, push the knees out and come up as fast as you can. Now that moving coming up fast is advanced, so if you're not ready to do that, Come up nice and slow. Going down slow, being a little more assertive on the concentric power is totally acceptable if you feel ready. If you're not ready, due to knees, lower back, hips, just come up nice and slow. 